Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Aries. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other uh, placements. Your messages could be there. Aries. Aries, you are about to learn something. It hasn't happened yet, but uh, it it's... It's funny how it's, the cards are laid out because it's like it's behind you. She's looking forward here. So it's almost like, uh, I feel like it's things you've been putting off, letting pile up. And you see, we know that you don't have news about these things that are about to come out um, because these rods are still firmly planted in the, in the ground. And this talks to something, the volcano talks to something that's coming to the surface. So it hasn't come to the surface yet, but it is coming. Mm, possibly within an eight, okay, eight days, eight weeks. Um, and I feel like um, it's going to shake everything up. Um, it may cause you some grief. Um, because I feel like you learn something and uh, a lot of it is stuff you've been putting off and letting pile up. Maybe you were, you didn't want to talk about it with this with your partner. Maybe you let things slide with your partner. Uh, maybe you thought it would make matters worse. But for, for whatever reason, uh, there you let some things slide or pile up here. Um, and those things are now going to be brought to the surface. They're forced into the surface. So something happens either, I mean, it could be that this person comes and gives you a full confession about something. I feel like there's, there's things you put off, but I feel like there's also some shocking news or a shocking surprise here. It feels like you're going to learn about something they did, but they admit that it was a mistake. They're going to tell you it was a mistake. They're going to tell you that they love you, okay, and that they made a mistake. We see it over here in this card of humanity, and we have the card of love here. It could be that you might learn of an affair, or that if there was an affair in the past, that maybe it's something that repeated. At whatever this is that this person has done, they, uh, they're going to tell you it was a mistake and that it's over and that they want to have another chance with you. And they will want your forgiveness for whatever it is they've done. We see them here. There they are depressed, and here they are wanting uh, or bringing another opportunity, okay? Oops, goes there. Yeah, they don't want this ending. See, there's the coffin. So there could be, uh, there's a private conversation that takes place between you and this person about something that's been going on uh, with your person in your community or, or yeah, in your community because you have the community card. Something they've been doing outside of the house. And we see that there's like a certain expectation. So, uh... This would have been something that you didn't really want to talk about. You, because you were hoping that you would never have to, that you were hoping that it would never happen, but it, it, it happens. But it was a mistake, they say. Whatever this is, you are, um, you have the card of bravery here. So this is something that, um, this could be making a decision. This could be uh, having the courage to do something.
So this news, whatever comes to the surface, makes you angry. There it is. Somebody has been keeping a secret. And so you're angry at this Knight of Cups. Um, but this Knight of Cups now, here he is um, bringing in the sun. So he's bringing some, you some clarity. Um, and I feel that whatever it was, there was like a certain expectation or a certain, you thought that there could have been a possibility, but you were hoping that it wasn't. Okay, so I feel like your person is really got something on their mind. They've got a guilty conscience for whatever this is they've done. They're very emotional and they're feeling very uh, insecure and uh, they're not grounded at all. Um, this person, uh, is it's possible that this person uh, gives you a full confession. We see them giving you messages, sending you messages, or uh, communicating something to you. Getting something off their chest, and it's very emotional. Um, this could be them wanting to uh, make up with you. Uh, wanting a reconciliation after uh, something that they've done. Yeah, because there they are, you know, like, uh, here they are, this king, okay, and um, maybe he wants this negotiation, because he is a negotiator, so he wants to talk to you about something, wants to make you a deal, or a new promise about something, and uh, he's coming with this card here of the Eight of Coins. And this is a card in this particular deck. It speaks to uh, wanting to get something back on its feet, okay? So um, this, is, this is it. This is a new promise or a new deal, uh, a new agreement um, between you and this, uh, this partner, this person, um, in order to get the relationship back on its feet or in order to get you back. This person is uh, very afraid that you may not take them back, that you might not believe them, you know. You, I mean, you believed them before, right? And you got, uh, you got burned, the consequence of that action. So it's, I feel like you're going to think twice about this. You're going to think twice about this. But the card of love is here. I feel like you do uh, love this person. Um, and this card of love can also uh, signal love affairs. So maybe they did have an affair. Maybe this was uh, something that did happen in the past. Uh, that maybe they did it again, you know. Um, and they're telling you clearly, it's a mistake. I feel terrible. I never should have done it. And so then they try... Uh, to bring in a new opportunity because they don't want this ending. Uh, there you go. There's the courtship. They're still very attracted to you. Um, but, you know, they uh, maybe you don't know if this person loves you after all of this because uh, Cupid is missing his, uh, his arrow. So that could be uh, you questioning uh, whether this person really loves you or not, you know. So uh, it feels like the ball is going to be in your court here. Um, and you're going to have to decide whether you uh, wish to take a chance. Uh, because the bravery card is also about taking chances. So um, you may be wondering if you should take a chance on this person again. Okay, so uh, that is what I have for you. I thank you for watching for liking and for sharing my videos and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.